everybody, Ginger Shadow here, and welcome back to some more of the Naruto World mod pack with me. And oh, I've been a busy boy off camera, clearing off more land, murdering people because they're getting in my way, and I'm not even kidding about that one this time. Like, ah, uh, the bar. I'm currently level 300, so I sat for a bit doing some grinding. People decided while I was sitting, like, I, I don't just go down and kill, I don't sit in the thing, kill the slimes. I like, I sit, like, in the room, let the slimes build up a little bit. Maybe I'll be like, you know, watching a YouTube video or on my iPad or something at the same time. Wait five odd minutes, then go on and kill them all, you know? I'm still standing there. I still very much can hear what's going on in the game. And I'm still very much watching the screen in front of me part of the time. Like, I'm not watching it continuously, but, you know, I'm still watching it. So, for some reason, uh, who was it? Hold on, I think he's still on the set. Yeah, John Qu uh, Quinones. I, I don't know how you pronounce that name. I'm going to have to in a second. I'm pretty sure he's on the signs. Um, but yeah, so he decided, hey, can I use Genji's slime pit? And I think it was, yeah, Aura showed him where it was. Okay. Then he saw I was there and decided to start killing my slimes. So I murdered him. Then I attacked Aura, although Aura left. And Aura has a lot of health and defense. I couldn't kill him very quickly. So, you know, he. I basically told him, right, you two are barbed out of here. And, well, one was already dead, so he was already gone. Aura went away. I don't think Aura actually technically killed any. By the time, like, I just, I saw him jump into the slime pits. So I thought he was planning to kill them as well. But I don't think he actually killed any, though. But either way. Um, basically, I was busy killing John when Aura jumped in the slime pit. I thought he was off to go murder Sam, but whatever. So that was one time. Okay, that happened. I'm still in the room after that. All that had happened. But 20 minutes later. Where is he? Jay the Beast. There we go. Jay the Beast 98. I'm standing there waiting the slimes to build up. He does the same bloody thing! He walks in and starts trying to kill me slimes. <laughs> so I go Sharon gun on and start murdering him as well. <laughs> I'm like, you! Banned from my slime room. Get out of here. What are people thinking? If I'm standing in that room, there's a fairly high chance I'm using it. Like, I might be slightly AFK, but I'm still going to be around. Like, at the very at the very most, I've left the room temporarily to go do something. I'm pretty sure Aura's actually using my slime pit right now. I mean, it's, that's fine. I'll let, I'll let him get away with it. I did actually say he was barred, but, like, I'll let him get away with it, because I don't think he actually killed any of my slimes. So, I guess I'll pass in that regard. I think he just showed a person, you know, where the room was. But it doesn't fall. Either way... My desk, what the, what is this? Right, anyway, let's go over here and get whitelisted, and then we'll, we'll move on from there and do some bits and pieces after st and then story time. Right, new member in the channel, John Quinn, welcome to the server. You got murdered by me straight away. <laughs> to be fair, though, he should have known better. All right, yeah, so uh, John Quinn, Quinn Anons? Maybe how it's pronounced. But yeah, uh, you've been whitelisted. He already knows he's on. Um... And two people were added from the uh, comment section. We've got Rifter Wolf and Power Triple. Due to being waitlisted, mod pack and people not should be down below. Also, Panda Enemy One, you're already waitlisted. Stop asking to go on. <laughs> you're already on. Ah, oh, right. You three have been waitlisted until though. Mod pack and people not should be down below. No, we thing, we thing, thing, thing. I've got my join button at last. Oh, I've been talking about it for the last like week odd. When did I start talking about it? I don't know. I don't know how long it's been since I put in the thing to try and get it. But, yeah, it's finally appeared. Oh, it's a, it was a beautiful day for me today. Basically, uh, yesterday, I think it was, yeah, yeah yes, yesterday afternoon-ish, I, I spoke to an artist about, um, basically getting a new banner done. It's basically, I saw Pad got one done, and I just, I saw the artist, and I'm like, well, they did the job, so they're reliable, so let's ask them. I saw their work in that, and I'm like, yeah, okay, this is quite nice. That, yeah, I, I quite like their style in that. Yeah, let's go with this. So, basically, gave them the details... They started it, they finished it, they sent it to me this morning. Awesome! I got a new banner in the channel. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. I know I tend to like red and um, black is my colours. Uh, no, I can, I, yeah, I'm can. perfectly fine with this it not being red and black. I'm perfectly fine with that. It's beautiful. <laughs> but anyway, so there's that. But then when I was changing it, uh, like I my page reloaded because I was, I was updating the, the banner. The join button appeared. Yay! I've got it now, so right, if anyone wants to become a member, boom, there's a join button, unless you're on a phone, I think. I don't think you saw that on the phone, maybe. In which case, I think there's a link in the descriptions of the videos. But still, join button's here, yay! It's about time, also, I saw my name there. I can I trade you the items, and you get it from creative. What? What is he talking about? What is he talking about? What? Da -ba -da -ba -da. I can't even go into creative and spawn to test. Jay, you can go 
and still slaying farm wait what? Wow. Jim, you can't even slow the slaying farm free. Alright, no, Jay's off killing his slaying now. Wait, what are they talking about? I wasn't I wasn't paying attention to the chat, I was too busy ranting. Um I have an item skill in it as well for sharing gun. Alright, click it says not enough jutsu points. But in the description, there's not a number. The hell are they talking about? Alright, now all I know is the saw the Jinji can I trade you the items and you get it from creative mode. I have no idea what they're talking about. I need more what I what items what? Like I have no idea what they're talking about. Blah I'm confused. Right, yeah, cleared off more land. Put more of a wall up. It's not really a wall, it's just, it's just more, I'm, I'm putting like a, a bit around the water, like, I guess it's also acting as a marker for my territory. But yeah, I plan to like flatten some more of the land and stuff around here, so, you know, I'm going to be busy. Well, that's not a good sign. There we go. Oh, it's lagging a bit. Right, um, iron bushing set, set. What? Iron what? It's from Ancient Warfare. Oh, okay. It's like that. Okay. But the, the, it's a recite conflict. Oh, that makes more sense. Why did it just start with that? <laughs> Why did it just start by telling me there was a recite conflict? I can fix that. I've got custom NPCs to fix that. Hold on. All right. I'm going to quickly, quickly pause and I'll quickly fix this uh, recite conflict. Since, yeah, they're doing Ancient Warfare stuff for a village, so... Aye, right, let's let me fix that really quick, and then we'll get back to. Well, we're just doing a quick tour there. I think we're pretty much done this tour, aren't we? Yeah, we're like yeah. Duh, duh, duh. Fix bits of land, clear bits of land, made more space. Slowly but surely, working my way across this land. Eventually, I'll figure out where I'm kind of stopping and put I don't know a fence or something up. And yeah, da da da. Oh, I don't know what else to say about it. Really. Right? Yeah. Okay. Let me go fix this. The fuck is that? Right, okay, so I've gave, gave that thing a new recipe now. Cool, that's that all sorted. Hopefully, I guess we'll find out. But right, okay, so things, 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 things. One, I need to figure out what the feck that is up there. Someone's decided to build a base on top of my tree. Not too thrilled about that. We'll be fixing that in a second. Right, bolt girls, I've got a million of them. I want to break them down and get all their bits and put all the bits in this chest here and all that stuff. How do you make a bolt girl uh, hemier again? Call. Dismantle hammer. Where are you? There it is. It is this stuff. Okay, that's not too expensive. We can make one of those. I made one of those not uh, not too long ago in Dragon Block. Right, I'm going to break down all the bot girls I've got here. And I plan to pretty much build my own one. It's lagging. Oh dear. Oh dear. Uh, all right, grab that. Grab that. 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 Do. No, that there, that there. Dismantle hammer! Yay! Don't worry, you'll never be dismantled. Du, du, du. Right! <laughs> I've got a few of them. Um, Wait, hold on. Let me take this bag first. I'm going to be able to fill this in my inventory. Probably not. Right, there's me hammer. Then, Skadoosh. Skadoosh. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, this isn't going to fit at all, is it? Nope. Okay. Right, I'm not going to do this lot right now. I'll do this lot right now, and I'll do the rest later, I guess, because I don't feel like doing, like, all of them right now, so... Yeah. This will get tons and tons of parts, though, so now if we want to build one of our own book girls, we can. There we go. Basically, I can't reach you. Ah, we're fine. Du -du 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 -du. I am pretty sure some of those parts just went outside or something there. Probably. I oh, know, actually, yeah, they're going to give you a living at a time. Do, 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 do. Damn, I can't find any hollows. You might want to try it at night in a desert. Oh, laggy lagginess. Oh, I don't like that. Do, do, do. But I guess whoever decided, like, you know, they were going to build a base underneath my sign thing, I decided, like, hey, since I can't build underneath because Jinji keeps stopping me, I'm just going to build one above. I didn't think I, I didn't think that I saw, like, a weird brown marker thing on my, on my tree on the map. I originally thought I was just going mad, though. No. No, as it turns out, I was not. Right. Tons of that stuff. Can build our own things later. Oh, it's nighttime. Right. Oh, packages. Hello. What is this? 
Where are you? That's a zombie. Hi! Fire off! Never stood a chance. Yes, yeah, so there's some. There is stuff outside! I wasn't going crazy. They did actually blurt some out. Cool. Alright. I'll get start there. Can't find any holes, he says. Yeah, I can see a few. Right, what have I got in here? More! <laughs> More tail base scrolls. I don't know where these are opened. What are these for? Kurama, Shikaku, and Kokyo. I mean, I've got so many of them already. <laughs> I don't need more. I mean, I get it, they're open, but still. And another one! Jesus Christ. That was from Jay the Beast and Burning Skull. They're giving me tail beast at this point. I have the things! I just don't think fighting a tail beast is very smart at this point. Like, I just don't have the. Like, Okay, technically I could fight tail beasts, because tail beasts are simplistic creatures, like as long as you're far enough away, you're going to be able to hit them, and that, then you're fine. I, it's boring though, like it'll take ages and it's, it'll be boring. So I don't really want to do that if that's all it's going to be. You know, I wanted to wait until like I was a bit stronger so I could actually like try a variation of moves and stuff, all that kind of jazz. Obviously I don't want to wait too, too long, because if I wait too, too long it's going to take me like forever and ever and ever to actually unlock the thing but still like I don't I don't want I'm not gonna jump to it though I'm not gonna rush to it there's no rush at least I don't think there's a rush all right anyway though box what the heck is that that is in the way we've I've got my lumber axe all right it's got lots of durability all right let's go up there and see what that is someone's built a thing and it needs to die why are people building on top of my tree like what is this they think they are also, I have no good way of getting up here, do I? No, not really. Oh, I can take more of the saplings from here, though. That'll be of interest later. Oh, yeah, so I'll be able to use those and can't plant more trees. Da, 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 da. There we go. Alright, where is this? Da, 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 da. I wondered why I kept hearing teleport things up here. Homo Zolus, not anymore, it's not. Is there a teleport thing up here by any chance? Probably, I'm taking these. Yep, this all can get demolished, I don't care. Um, oh, no, 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 get out of there. Didn't mean to do that. Alright, goodbye, house. Why are they built up here? What is the point in this? It's on top of my tree. <laughs> I mean, we're not quite understanding, like, you know, my stuff being my area and all that jazz, you know? We're not we're not quite understanding this. Like, build your build somewhere else. This just looks horrible from the top of my tree, though. Like, it's just a big wooden blob bit sticking out the side of my tree. No. Feck off. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. There we go. It's hard to tell because there's a cloud trying to get in my way, but I'm pretty sure that's all of it gone. Right, there's no other bloody things up here, is there? Feels weird being this high up. Da, 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 da. Okay, now I think the original wooden bit that I saw was this bit over here. Oh, 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 oh. 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 What the feck is this? Sage mode training, maybe? Actually, might be as well. What is this? What's this all about? Jesus Christ. Right, anyway. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's gonna it's all disappearing. I'll be having words with Zolus next time I see him. Or I'll be trying to murder him, one of the two. I'll go figure out which is it's in due time. Right, okay, that's out the way then. Da, 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 da. Should we go into all our matters now that I'm done cleaning up everyone's mace? Oh, I think we shall. I can jump off here, alright? I mean, if I hit the water, sure. Like, I don't take fall damage. And I'm not gonna test it, but you know. Oh, my shins would be utterly destroyed there! <laughs> hitting the water from that head shot, it's like, oh yeah, you can hit the ground and that'll be fine. No, hit the water, you'll be fine. Technically, like, hitting the water would be just as bad. But you know, it's Minecraft, so it's not as bad. But still, hitting the water though, Jesus. From that height, that'd be nice. <laughs> Alright, fill that in there. Redwood saplings. I might want to put more of those trees around somewhere. I don't know where. I might want to plant them in very specific locations. Is like maybe markers or borders to my land. 
Ooh, we'll figure it, we'll figure something out there. All right, put all this away. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. All right, that's all done. Right, other things I want to do really quick. I have that teleport ability. I've not started enhancing it. Oh wait, hold on. Also, just to double check, like the same thing's turned off, right? No one left it on. Yeah, cool. Ba -ba -da. I just want to confirm in case things start like suddenly lagging. It's because someone's decided to come in here and like you know not turn it off. But it's fine. It's fine. People have turned it off. It's all good. All right. I got teleport powers. I want to start using them on stuff. Let's build the uh, data terminal. Yes, build the data terminal so I can put that in. So I can actually adjust myself slightly because I need to do that. So we should have the means to do this quite easily. Because yeah, we've got an absolute crap ton of iron. We've got not a ton of redstone, but we've got enough. They've got all these bits. There's glowstone. Anything else? No, I think that's it. Yeah, okay. So, let's make this really quick. This should be the only thing I need to make for this, because technically... Yeah I've, got all my, yeah, I've got my moves unlocked. So yeah, technically I just need that just so I can get started. And after that, like, we can just say what we're doing from there. So, okay. Uh, wait, is this a... That's a crafting bench. Do I have a crafting station anywhere? I think I'm going to go downstairs and do this, because I've got crafting benches and crafting stations downstairs. Right, yeah, it's a crafting station here. So, right. What do we need? We need... We need a glass plane as well. Bloody hell. Right, we need that. I got a crafting bench here. I really don't. What the heck? There's just no rooms where I've got everything I need. All right, whatever. Do the old-fashioned way. The old-fashioned way. I was hoping that they have a crafting station and a crafting bench so I could put, like, stuff in the crafting station, hold it in place, and then, you know... Switch over as I needed to, but never mind. We're not doing that then. Right. Glass planes. Do I have glass? Yes. Do I have glass planes? Yes. Right. That's that sorted. Redstone block. We have redstone. Boom. There we have a block. Right. There's that. Uh, two data chips. That requires redstone and two of these per each one. But next up, we've got information processors. That's a data chip with that. Cool. We need two more then. Actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to guess we need three because things. Because, yeah, what's this requiring? Oh! Nuggets, damn it. The one thing I forgot about. Yeah, that's not a thing. Okay, uh, put sticks away. Oh, I've got these, though. Perfect. Alright. Now they are there. there. Oh. All the way around. Nope. Oh, it's calculation shit, that's why. That makes more sense. That's not calculation chip. That's a calculation chip. Calculation chip. Da da. Da da. There we go. Brain analyzer. Next up, we need two of these with two of these. Yes. Yes. Gets us those two. Those two. That. That. That and that. What's wrong? Oh. Da, da, da. There we go. That was easy, Elsie. Install that. Let's make a few modifications to myself, you know, as you do. Right. Okay, now we've got this Garking. So now we can actually start changing, doing things and stuff. So, okay. Active ability with V. Ah. Da, 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 da. Edit present. Yeah. Change that to O. Because that's in the way. Switch present. Don't think I actually need that. Okay, cool. Uh, open terminal. Ability one. Oh, dear. Abilities. That's... Uh... Uh... God. What am I putting these on? I don't know. Right, put them on there then. I know that won't work because I know, like... The fix the button to open this up. Open data turn on that. No. Make it in. Right, yeah. Yeah, so ours do that. I don't need that though. Yeah, turn that off. Yeah, turn that off. I don't need I don't need to draw weapons right because I'm not really using double weapons for anything. Now, F is my sharring gun. That's the only one that's like bad. Activate chakra, deactivate chakra. Charging chakra, which I've already got full. Edit present there. Okay, 
But 30, okay, so I only have one ability right now, so this is fine still. I can use, just use R and do it that way. So what do I want to use then for it? I actually thought about this. I can use Shuriken for this. If I want to train this ability, I can just use Shuriken. They'd be vanishing Shuriken at this point, but yeah, I can just use Shuriken. Do, 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 do. Put that there, that there, that there. Well, these can go back in here. Do, 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 do. There we go. I just need to be super, super careful with my ability so I don't accidentally launch my bag because then there's like a, a fairly good chance it'll just vanish and never come back. Right. I can use shuriken and stuff. I just need to make sure I don't have anything else nearby when I'm doing it. So, wait. Act two abilities with what? V? Yeah. Okay, so this is V to activate abilities. I have nothing on this button. Oh, yeah, I could change this button then. Up the door. Yeah, so change it from R to there. There we go. Wait. Oh, wait. What? Oh, I put charge chakra on there. Why? Oh, yeah, because edit present was took up. Hold on. <laughs> oh, I keep switching buttons around. Bloody hell. All right, yeah. Change that. Back to that. That's where it originally was. Yes, that'll do. Right, okay, so that's now that. And now... I don't have my abilities turned on. Um, that one. Boom. Uh-oh. There we go. Now we can do it. Oh, it's doing fives. No, it's not. Oh, 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 oh. I just realized it's, it's counting as Naruto damage. Oh, wait. Is that because I'm holding a shuriken, though? Ooh. Can, uh, can we confirm this? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. This will confirm how this damage is going to work. Hold on. If I throw shurikens, it counts as Naruto damage, which... Or it counts as Naruto melee damage, which doesn't work on those things. It's not, throw, it's not thrown damage. It's melee damage. Because that's what I'm holding when I'm using it. If I use a stick, though, yay, it instantly damages. Okay, so yeah, it's, it's very much working the same way. Okay, interesting. It's working the same way the stands do. Right, so I can't use the shuriken. <laughs> Even though I'm technically throwing them, it acts as if I'm punching with them. Because right now, I can't actually punch with it because I don't have the kenjutsu for it. But technically, if you punch with a shuriken, it counts under the kenjutsu taijutsu law. So that doesn't work. So I can do the vanishing shuriken technique, but that's not going to... Actually, is that better, actually? Technically, right now, I can just keep hitting with this forever. Because that mob will ne well, it'll, it'll get injured occasionally. But for the most part, it's never going to get injured. Ooh. I can just hit the same thing over and over again. Then I can also just do this to Evelyn or the world, and this, this would work just as good. But still. Interesting. Okay. Also, we only do threes. The ten damage that they already took must have been from the witch McCullough. Oh, it'd be cool if we could do shuriken and do more damage and a vanishing shuriken technique. That'd be nice. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, well. Never mind. So, you have to make sure it's an item that, you know, I'm not going to, like, miss. Which, to be fair, sticks and shurikens are easy to make. I've got a million iron, and I've got, like, a million more iron to get from underneath in the slime room. Like... Because of the slimes, it's so easy to get iron. So I'm not, I'm not worried about that in the slightest. Like, game. There we go. Uh yeah. There's like, there's so much iron. So, and you get fifty shurikens per thing. So I might, I might just stick with the shurikens, even though I'm not doing any damage with them. I mean, technically, if I, if I attack things without the Naruto thing applying to them, it'll do damage. Hold on. Okay, but that's interesting, though. So that means that's how teleport works. So I want to imagine, as far as Meltdowner, Victim Manipulator, and Electromaster work, they probably follow the logic of whatever's in your hand. Up, it counts as like the damage, the damage system to it. Like, so if I if I'm holding like the scythe and I use the Electromaster technique, I want to imagine the lightning will do damage. Whereas if I'm using my bare fists, or if I'm using a sword and I use the Electromaster technique, it'll count as if I'm using my fists and sword in terms of damage. That's how the Naruto systems want to want to work. Interesting. Yes, yeah, so I can hurt. I can hurt this because this doesn't have anything to, d to protect itself with. Interesting. Oh. 
Yeah, because it, it falls under Shuriken Jutsu. It just can't protect itself from Kenjutsu. For reasons. Okay. Alright, well, this, this won't be too, too hard to train up then, I guess. It's going to take time, you know. Not going to be too, too hard to train up. Okay. But I completely missed there. But. Oh, yeah, wait, doesn't it get stronger as well? But also, I guess it also means, yeah, if I want to just target the one thing and not ever kill it, I can just go after, like, one of the girls there, leaving a hole, and boom, I can just hit it forever. Because it's almost never going to do damage. And even when I do enough damage, these things heal themselves. So, like, they'll just they'll kill themselves back to feel well before I can get any damage done. Aw. See, if you could stop running around so madly, that'd be great. Oh, you horrible thing. Just die. Just get out of here. Put the ball. Ah, oh, well. I need to stop this, baby. I'm going to get start getting hired away and just keep doing this. I kind of want to kill this thing. Oh, hold on. We need to end this. Also, oh, do, do. oh, hold on. Get out of hand while I'm doing this. Um, Turn off. Need to be extra, extra careful with that move. Because that's a, one of the moves that could easily end up destroying your stuff. Ugh. We're fine. Okay, we're fine. Oh! Another thing. My son's disappeared. Anyone surprised by that? I'm not. It's one of my servers. So of course my son vanished within a day of getting him. That's not surprising in the slightest. I wonder who took him slash killed him slash left the door open so something killed him. I mean, there's no, there's no remains from him. There's no... Um, box or anything anywhere. The toy form or anything. So, I don't know what's happened with them. There's a million things it could be. It could be someone's just used, um, whatchamacallit. A teleport ability and took him away. Or it could be something completely different. Not a clue. Alright, I'll hang on to the shuriken because apparently I'm going to need them. So, that's a thing. Da, 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 da. I was going to say, do I want to start building one of my boat girls? Probably not right now. I need more lava for it anyway, and I'm probably gonna, it's probably going to take a few attempts to get the bulk girl I want. Alright, my place is slowly starting to shape up then. We're slowly, slowly, slowly starting to get there. Oh wait, hold on, I've just realised that like, I've just started like, training up that stuff. How's down here looking? Wrong button. Because sure, this, the place down here got uh, wrecks. So I'm wondering, like, is, it, is it mostly repaired now? No, it's still wrecked. So that means that quite possibly... Yeah, the, ele the electronic devices and stuff. The witch my An anvil! Um, yeah, that means that the machines and that are all gone. I'm going to make my own then. Okay, cool. But at least I know I've got to do it. Oh, fun fact. The person that did this, by the way, um, they got banned uh, instantly. I, I, I saw a comment saying, Oh, you need to make you need, you need need to do something about this. Do you people are just going to do it whenever they want? I banned them. They're banned from all the servers. People that don't get back on. Like, that's the best thing you can do. <laughs> Bane 2 does it in ban them, because if you punish them like that, like, they're gone forever. You have to worry about them ever again. They can't get back on. Even if they change their in-game name, that their name's still banned, because the, the game, the servers still remember what your name used to be. So that person's never coming back. So, yeah, people were th saying like that kind of stuff. Yeah, don't worry about it. I, it's fine. We'll be fine. <laughs> Those types of people are gone. But, um... Yeah, no, I got a comment from the person saying, hey, I think my ban was a bit unnecessary. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> you broke my rules, which I said you'd get banned for breaking, and you think it's unnecessary? You are a muppet. But then I'm like, yeah, no, mate, you just, you break someone's place. You break another person's place, because I'm told the Quincy place got done in as well. And then you left a sign trying to say that, like, it was something for me. Oh, I just did it so you had some content. That's not content! Don't try it. Don't talk out your backside. That's not content. Content of uh, what? So you tore down someone else's base. And that's content for me. In what way? <laughs> How does that do anything for me? I didn't see it happen. You know, it didn't happen on my line of sight. So, you know, it's nothing like, it's not content in that sense, is it? And even then, it's one of those things where I always say, don't do that stuff. I'm very much against it. It's pointless. If you're going to battle and like destroy stuff, best save it to the very end of the series where, you know, it doesn't matter if stuff gets broken. Because at that point, the world's going to get deleted anyway. Aww. I'd rather see big, beautiful structures and villages get built. So we have these big, beautiful places to visit and do stuff with. Because that's what we did in Season 1 of Naruto. We, had, we all had like bunch of villages and stuff. And then we just did stuff in them. And it was fun. <laughs> ah, Either way. I just... Yeah, the warning's out there. Obviously, if it, the warning's always been out there. But yeah, people step out of line this type of stuff, you know, they'll get banned. They're never back on the server. They're banned from all my servers, not just this one. 
Like, they did it, did it here. He's not going to get let on Dragon Block after this, because why the fuck would I let him on Dragon Block after this? <laughs> that would be dumb. Now nah, he's outy. So, ah, anyway, that was that. Also, I just remembered, I did a bit before this. Hold on. How long was that last bit? It was that long. Cool. I just remembered, I had to split this, didn't I? Because I had to go fix the recipe thing. Let's put this stuff away. Why is there a bag in there? I put that in there. Wrong thing. There we go. Right. All right. So I can start training my my um thingy abilities now. Cool. I would. Okay. So I did actually get some jutsu points while I was like obviously training stuff. I also get more. Ooh, skill points. Ooh, there's the thing I'm curious about. Should we put? I want to test game jutsu again. Hold on. I need, I need iron golems for this. They have pumpkins. Please tell me I've got pumpkins. I've got one. <laughs> Damn it! I need more! Um, oh, I can make a farm, can I? Yeah, I've got tons of pumpkin seeds. Alright, I'll make more pump I'll make more pumpkins later. But I need yeah, I need something with a lot of health to test. I want to test my Genjutsu and see if it gets stronger. Essentially. So I've got what I've got one little golem to test this with. This is fine. Right. Nerf. There we go. Right, my golem, my friend. Wait, did I put... Oh, I forgot they came like this. Wait, hold on. Did I put the extra golems one in? I did not. Cool. Um, yeah, no, sometimes I put the extra golems mod in, which makes, all, like, a bunch of different golems available in the, in the game, but I didn't put that in this time. Right. Curiosity. Sharingan. If I, uh, use the Sharingan at this point... Jesus Christ. It will do... 43 damage. Okay. Now, if I put 50 more points, or 49 points, sorry, into Genjutsu, increasing it to 100. How much damage do we do now? Ooh. What did that do there? <laughs> I don't know. The other way, you. Hold on. There's a bug. No. Oh, thank God you didn't die. Right, hold on. It's on 6 health now. Wait, so it, it, we did 43 before. That put it down to 57. And from 57 to 6, which is... 51. Yeah. Okay, so I did 51. So it went from 43 to 51. Ooh. Ooh, that does... Oh, it goes up by a fair bit. Ooh, I like that. Oh, yeah. We're going all in the Genjutsu. That's, that's it, then. We're going all in the Genjutsu. Oh. Alright. Alright, do I have a way to heal you, by the way? I don't think so. Oh. Be nice if I had a way to heal you, so, you know, I didn't lose you. But, alas, I don't think I've got a method to actually heal you up. Yeah, the Bang Club, the... Get those splash potions out of them, but that's... Uh, not very that helpful. Are any healing things? Ah, oh, they're not... There's a Maki Bait thing would work. Maybe. Uh, is it worth it? Ah, oh, just leave him. Sorry, Gollum. Sorry. I actually would like to keep you alive, but alas. Like, I, I realize that if I get someone here to uh, revive you, someone else is just going to kill you later. So. Oh. I, mean, I can ask. Also, I need t to seriously hurt someone to become a vampire. Any volunteers? Do you? I'm pretty sure after you just do any damage to anyone, you become a vampire. Also, he's going to become a vampire. They really hurt in the sun, so good luck to him. Da, 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 da. Uzumaki. Ba, ba, da. And it was a Maki clan around to heal an injured golem. <laughs> oh, oh, it's golem, not golem. Oh, whatever. Wait, is anyone around that has the healing arts? Wait, hold on. Healing arts? We have healing arts. Boop. But, like... Oh... Uh, uh, I don't know how far in it is, and I don't, I don't really want to waste points in healing arts. Oh, well, never mind. Sorry, Gollum. I hope you. I do hope you live. I actually do hope you live, but I don't feel like it's very likely. Also, really feel like I should probably just put this here in this bit's list. 
Also, maybe I should be like a fence or something around this area as well. Err, something to think about. Then again, actually, I want to claim this little bit er, chunky area over here as well. Ooh. I need to have like a proper thing around this area. Hi! Shackling sticks! How much does this do? Oh, that did 54. No, it didn't. It did 44. Oh, yeah. Hold on, mate. You can only do so much damage to these guys, though, because they have a certain amount of defense, don't they? But, you know, they did 44. Oh, okay. No good. We are testing this. Hey, Phoenix Flower Jutsu. Get the way you. Oh, what else has a lot of health I could test this on? <laughs> oh, I want to know. I want to know. I want to know. Because, yeah, golems, I don't think they count as armored. So, like, it'll do the full damage. Whereas the uh, Game of Gaia stuff, it, they have a certain amount of base defense. Because you can, like, with your attacks, you can only ever do so much in one attack to them. It's not easy to one shot them unless you get damage that bypasses their defenses. But, yeah. Yeah, the first attack is 17. I think it's always guaranteed. I think that's like, the highest you can do to them or something. Yeah, six, eight, 16 with my scythe. My scythe's managed to 20. 17, so this is all. Oh. No, I did 24 there. Did my Genjutsu actually go up, or am I just bad at maths? Uh. No, like with the golem, it's down to 6. That means it's lost 94 health. And it lo we lost 43 in the first one. 94 minus. 43 is 51. My maths is right, right? I think it is. <laughs> you know what? I don't know. Either way. I like the idea of this doing, like, progressively more damage. It's definitely going to be, like, one of my more useful attacks against players. I think, yeah, I'm going to invest a load in Genjutsu as time goes. Although, oh, still really regretting that Shuriken Jutsu investment. And I probably need to start putting medical up too, because sooner or later, player combat's going to be a thing, isn't it? Like... After I clear up my land and that, inevitably I'm gonna build a tournament arena. Cause of course I bloody am. At which point, you know. Nah. We have to start fighting people, aren't we? Yeah, did I build an arena or do I just like shove the one from that Naruto map in here? There's a question. Ugh. How big's the one the Naruto map actually? Can I fit in here? <laughs> That's a better question. I think I could fit it. I don't think it's too too big. I think I could probably shove it over this side. Yeah, I could probably fit it over here. May not fit like Easily up that hell hammed here. Oh, wait, this is me putting land in. May not fit, like, the most snugly snugly, but, like, yeah, it should probably fit. Hmm. It's an idea. It's an idea. All right. Okay, well, I'm, I'm liking I'm liking the Genjutsu investment. Are there any other things I want to buy, though? No. Because, yeah, okay, the wind and lightning thing. That was something else I wanted to invest in, wasn't it? I want to just start working on wind. Just start working my way towards the Rising Shuriken. Good. But then also people were saying the earth golems are really handy, but how fine is the earth golem jutsu? Earth! What, what jutsus are there on earth? We've got... I think, oh, I think earth golem's literally the last jutsu in it. I think it's like the last jutsu, because right, you get earth release, you've got... Alright, there's earth spear in there, I don't remember that one really well. There's earth wall, and that's quite early. There's sand, waterfall, burial, I'm pretty sure that's quite early. Sand tsunami, I think, I don't know, I... Oh. The, sand, uh, the, uh, the shield's quite er uh, Yeah, the shield's early on as well. Oh. I, uh, I, Golem must be like one of the last jutsus, isn't it? I'm not sure. You know, I don't know. Because I've never tried it. So I'm just not going to care about it. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking about using that as like a training method. Why the hell would I want to spend so many jutsu points on just training? Yeah, no, in fact, no, I'm not doing that. That's, that's very counterproductive. <laughs> Spend lots of training points so I can get more training points. Mm, when I could just use my scythe, or I could use a great fireball, or I could use another technique. Yeah, okay, let's not do that. Uh, all right, yeah. Earth's completely out the window. So it's wind or lightning. Well, what else is there in lightning? Lightning mode's obviously tempting. Is there anything else in it I actually want to invest in? I like, I like the lariat move, but it's crap in terms of damage later on. Like, it's good early game, but it's crap once people have got stuff on. Uh, should already shout out spear we don't get from here. Should I send bonds in here? Kieran's in here, and I forget how strong it actually is, but still, eh. Yeah, I think I just invest in wind at this point. I think I just invest in wind. Wind's got a lot of moves I really don't care about, but, you know. The Rising Shuriken at the end. There we go, Jay the Beast is saying he's got Rising Shuriken. 
Yeah, it's, it's worth it just for that. So yeah, let's unlock some jutsus from it then. We're going to invest in Windstall so we can start getting our Rising Shuriken at some point. So, boop. How many points have I got? 28. So first thing we get is Vacuum Sphere. A little burst of wind, not very good. Wind Mode, that one's actually useful, so keep hold of that. Air Bullets. Blah. That's all I can afford right now. There is at least three more Jutsus. There's going to be one that costs 20. Probably one that costs 30. And then the Rising Shuriken, which will cost 50. So about another 100 points. I need to get level 400 then. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, that's going to take a wee while, but that's fine. All right. Well, at least I got one Jutsu that's worth having. I got Wind Mode, which, if nothing else, is quite good. Gives him a big jump burst. Oh, very nice. Oh, very nice. <laughs> ah. Oh, I'm a springy boy now, aren't I? What does it give me? It gives me speed, haste, jump burst, and resistance. Wait, it gives me resistance? Really? I didn't know that. Oh, it drains chakra pretty quick, though. Oh, well, not really. It costs one. One per tick or whatever. So it's going down in twos. Oh, no, wait. No, it's not. It's because my sharing gun's on. That's why it's draining chakra so quick. Yeah, it'd be draining half this speed current uh, if I did my sharing gun off. It is off. Why is it still draining as quickly? Maybe it's, cause got, maybe it's just got to drain in twos then. Wait, is it actually... Yeah, it gives me resistance as well. That's neat. Oh, I like that. That's a handy wee thing to have. All right, well, yeah, I'm going to hang on to this then, because if I start building lots of big structures in this village, being able to bounce about them like this is going to be quite fun. All right, this works for me. I'm quite satisfied, right? Anyway, then, people, I think we'll call it a day there. We'll call it a day there. So I rants, breaking people's places, breaking people's faces. Did I say places first, then faces? I just say faces twice. You know what? I don't even know anymore. My brain is just at that point. But all right. Anyway, I people, don't build my tree. It's my tree. Bugger off. Oh, so don't kill my slimes when I'm in the slime room. It's my slime room. If I'm there, I'm the one training the the bar. Aye. Surely people realize that. <laughs> they chanced it going in against me. They were fools, really. Oh, what's what a candle doing here? Is he using his Imaki clan? He's not said anything. Da, 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 da. Well, whatever. Alright, yep, yeah, my son's gone. I'm slowly but surely gaining power and stuff. I'm slowly but surely fixing the land to my area, which eventually I'll do more stuff with. I, I Probably. I don't, exactly, I don't even know what my full plan is for the land. I know I'm going to build more structures. I just don't know exactly what all of them are going to be. Like, so far, I've seen, uh, obviously, like various shops can be an obvious thing. Um, for simple stuff, I guess. But I'll, or maybe I'm going to get permanent, like, Eruka Sensei. Right, you know, he sells, like, the the jutsu? I don't know. Figure something out. But yeah, okay, uh, we can definitely have some type of shop. Uh, I saw a thing for a ramen stand. That's definitely something worth building. And I, an arena is definitely something I want to get our hands on. Get uh, get built. So I've got plans. So I've got plans. Then. Right. Anyway, then, people, thank you all very much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed this show. I guess I'll do more off-camera work. Get some more bits cleared up. Level up more. Maybe eventually finish my house. We'll, we'll figure it out as time goes. But right. Anyway, then, people, thank you all very much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed this show. As always, if you want to have a chance to get on the server, leave a like on the video along with the end game down below for the chance to get on. And for every 100 likes, add the person onto the server. Or, for the first time ever, and I think you might be the first person to do this, whoever does it first, you can click the join button. It should be under, like, it should be under the video. And it should be on my main channel page now. You can click the join button to become a member. Or, if you, I think on mobile, because I don't think the join button shows up on mobile, I think at that point you can use the link in the description down below. And that will take you to like, YouTube Gaming to do all that stuff. But, right. Anyway, people, thank you all very much for watching. I will see you all next time for some more Naruto World Mod Pack. Goodbye, everybody.